Uh, we have indeed got the infrared on. Now, this is the young male. Um, the female is not far from us, just down the road. She did just give a territorial call, that sawing that the leopards do. You can hear, listen to him, he's still contact calling. It's interesting behavior. Beautiful, beautiful leopard. There we go, she's coming back up, there she comes. Oh, what, she's growling at him. That's very interesting behavior. Isn't this wonderful that we're able to see this so well at night and we don't have a single light on? Follow infrared, watch, watch, let's see what happens. It's just following her now. I'm going to drive around quickly, hold on. Wow, I think she went right down there down that embankment um, is she going to walk through the drainage line can you see her down there and you can see him at the top there we go she's lying down there is she yeah there she is you can just see he's still at the top wow she went straight down there um no, hold on a second. I'm going to try to drop down there. We might we might still get... I think we've got uh, decent enough signal down that side. So we'll still get a view of her. Uh, let me just turn around here quickly. I'll drop down into the Mulawati. But I'm sure our signal should be fine here. Now she was walking this way. Let's just have a look. Did she go back up there? Ah, oh, she's gone back up. <laughs> Both of them are just <laughs> they're now back up at the top. <laughs> we'll go back around quickly. Sure. <laughs> oh, little Wendy didn't almost didn't start there. That's uh, that would have been fun. Craig, when last did you push a Land Rover? <laughs> it's a lot of fun. I promise. Alright, let me see where these leopards are going. Oh, sorry, let's head back to Tara who's got a Franklin. And let's see, I'll see if I can get another view of these leopards. Now oh, these leopards are starting to move further up the drainage line. We may lose a bit of signal through here. Um, but they're going up the Mawati, which is good. That means maybe there's a, well, there's a chance that they could potentially stay on the property for the night. I'm not sure. Maybe we have luck tomorrow morning. Just trying to see there they go they're going through some long grass now everybody you can see straight ahead that leopards moving through there i think that is tandy up ahead and tumba was through here off to the right i'm going to keep the spotlight there we go there she goes what a wonderful afternoon spent with two leopards isn't that incredible really really special just having a look around we should see him maybe once more Or 
or not. <laughs> but what a nice afternoon. Interesting afternoon. Very, very interesting to see this behavior from these leopards. And to see that interaction, very special. And I'm so glad that we got to view that and appreciate that. Um, anyway, like I say, I'm not sure that they could potentially stay on the property for the evening. Um, moving around maybe again you know I'm gonna try go back and have a look I'm sure there's some screenshots and that I want to double check that it definitely is Osana I'm sure uh, all, of, all of you all the viewers and that have said it is him I just want to make sure it, but I, I don't know why it's a strange behavior it's very strange behavior to see a young male leopard follow a female like this that he has technically no connection with um, but uh, anyway, very, very interesting. All right. Oh, there's another vehicle coming. So they've moved along there. And I think we're going to start making our way back. Um, all right. So let's head back to Tara. And I think Tara will finish the show. We'll see you all tomorrow. Good night, everyone.